Welcome back to my channel. Did you come after saying that intro or puke? I hope you did something after that motherfucking thing. But of course, if you haven't already uh, guessed yet, today I am doing the full face using only glitter challenge. Now, let's do a quick little recap. This summer, me and Nikki Tutorials both uploaded our full face using only highlighters challenge together. Shout out to Maria, girl, a lot has happened since we all did that. And that was like six months ago in June. And since then, every month there is a full face using something type of product, which we've all done it now. But I think it's only fitting before this year is up to cover my entire existence in glitter and see what happens. Now, I've already been trying to match, uh, like my skin tone, and that's a hard one. I mean, nothing's natural about this challenge. Um, and today I'm mainly going to be using glitter injections. Look at that hollow porn though, okay. Uh, let's just, we gotta open this up real quick. Ooh, this is like heaven. So these are all glitters from Glitter Injections, which is a really cool brand that makes crazy glitters. And besides this one, I got even more glitters. You guys thought I was gonna play around with this challenge? We got some crazy shit today. Look at these big ones though, oof. Fuck, man. Besides that, and before we dive into this challenge, I have one quick thing to say. If you guys have been following me for a long time, you know that I used to do music for about nine, 10 years. A big chunk of my life, I spent touring the entire world and performing music. So a long time ago, I put out a vinyl record in 2012 that was in the shape of a heart, and it looks like this, and it sold out literally in like a few days and I never put out a vinyl record after that. I quit music and I of course started my makeup company and started teaching classes around the world. So this means a lot to me. Shout out to anyone that has this out there. You are one of only 5,000. I am actually gonna bring it back next year for the spring and I'm gonna press a few other colors for fun. On another note, I recently made a brand new vinyl in the shape of a star and it looks like this and it is for my single prom night that I put out in 2012. Oh my God, where is the time gone? And it looks like this. And these are almost sold out, but if you go to my website, jeffreystorecosmetics.com, there are a few more available and we are making a purple version of this. But there was only a few thousand of these made and they are flying. So, had to talk about that for a second. Now, if you want to see me cover my entire world in glitter, then keep on watching. All right, so I already have glitter in my hair and somehow on my forehead and I haven't even put anything on yet. Like glitter gets everywhere, but I'm kind of into it. Okay, so because glitter is so drying, um, I'm gonna just prime my face with the trusty tried and true Bobbi Brown Vitamin Enriched Face Base. If you've been here for a while, you know I've been using this on my channel on and off throughout the entire year. One of my favorites and we're just gonna Put this all over our skin. All right, now I guess the first thing you do is you try to find a foundation glitter color that matches you. And I put like three on, I don't even know. Like how do you shade match yourself with glitter? I'm scared. This one, maybe. That one is too dark. That's more like a bronze. And this is pure gold. Do I want a pure gold face? Kind of, honestly. Let's be really real here. So Glitter Injections has these uh, products called Glitter Highlighters, which I thought was really cool. And I found a shade called Margarita, which looks like this. And I don't know, you guys. I guess we, all we can do is try it. Now, I just put a little bit on my cheek, and I'm like, okay, this might work. So I'm just going to go in with my Oval 8 Artiste brush and pray for the best. So I'm just going to take this brush and kind of go, oh, oh. I mean, let's, let's, let's give it a whirl, y'all. Let's give it a whirl. All right, so I quickly took a five second break and I added a few more lights on the side because glitter, for some reason, when I'm looking directly at the camera, you kind of see it. And then when I turn, you're like, oh, fuck. So I just wanted a little more, uh. But um, all right, I'm not even done. My forehead is blank and my other part of my face is like, all right, uh, we're ready for more. So I'm just gonna pat this into the skin. 
I'm getting glitter everywhere, which is obviously the point of this challenge. Now I'm gonna go in with the shade Pina Colada from Glitter Injections, and I'm just gonna take my finger and just press this under my eye for like a little concealer effect. And the whole point of concealer is to, of course, conceal our flaws and discoloration, so this is the perfect product. And of course, we're gonna highlight our chin a little bit. Can't forget about that. And now, and when I say highlight, I mean conceal and highlight with a, with a um, you know, concealer. We're just gonna go down our nose a tiny bit and of course hit that forehead. All right, next step, we are going to take another Artiste brush and we're gonna do a little bit of contour. Now, whew, Lord help me. Now, Glitter Injections also has something called a glitter bronzer. And these are darker glitter shades. I'm not really sure what color to use for contour. There are two options. There is mint, uh, let's see, minty mocha and Amor de Verano. Okay, girl. Now, these are it. Oh my god, I'm like, do I do this one or do I do this one? Mm, I guess we can just try both and see what happens. I'm gonna go in with this one first, Minty Mocha. And, oh, come on, yes. And we're just gonna see what happens. Oh, wow. If you wanna get your cheekbones snatched for life, then you better use this one. I'm just gonna lightly contour this jaw. Hello, jawline, how's your day? And of course, I'm just gonna use the side of the brush and just barely go like that, and we're gonna snatch this nose, honey, yes. All right, contour is looking solid, yes. Come through, muddiness. <laughs> okay, I mean, for glitter, you guys, I'm not mad at this at all, I'm like, bitch, all right. Now, putting glitter on top of glitter on top of glitter, help me out, help me now. Next step, is we can either do eyes or we can highlight. I mean, I wanna highlight. Let's keep it really hood right now. Okay, so for highlighting, I'm actually gonna go in with this Martha Stewart Star Shaped Glitter. This is in shade Sugar Cube, and shout out to Adora Delano. I have never heard of these glitters before until she was on my channel, and now I am, I'm hooked. Ooh. Now I've never used these before, and you might need a little bit of a glitter adhesive, or I don't know, maybe you spit or lube or something. What do I got here? Fuck, man. Um, I'm just gonna do it with my finger and see what happens. So I'm just gonna take a little bit out. <gasps> oh my god, they're like iridescent unicorn stars. Like, look how pretty those are. <laughs> and I'm just gonna put these just where I would highlight normally on the high planes of my cheeks. <gasps> Ooh. They're like not leaving my finger, it's like, no bitch. I'm just gonna sprinkle them on my face like that, let them all fall down on my private area. <gasps> oh my god, these are so pretty. <gasps> oh. All right, now I'm just highlighting the cupid's bow and I guess half of my mouth. Ooh, that looks cute, look at that star right on my lip. Hi. <laughs> and we're just gonna take a little bit of the star glitter and just go down my nose, like, <gasps> hi there. Ooh, look at the little star on my nose. <laughs> All right, I think it's now time to move on to the eyes. So I'm gonna be going in with this little transition shade, of course, from Glitter Injections as well. And I'm just gonna use a synthetic Morphe brush. This is the G17. I've never really gone straight in on the lid like this, so I guess we can pretend this is a crease color. Oh, 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 shit. All right, we're just gonna pop that right in the crease. <laughs> yes. All right, now that that transition shade is in there, we definitely need a lid color. So I'm like, um, what do we have for the lids? I think I'm gonna go in with this gorgeous, like silvery pewter type of shade. And I'm just gonna put this on my lid. And what am I gonna even use for the fucking lid, girl? All right, I'm gonna go in with this little Artiste brush and we're just gonna dip right in there. <gasps> oh shit, you guys, okay. And let's just apply this directly on the lid. Oh, hi. Oh my God, look at those blending together. You better fucking work, eyes. This could be my everyday look, you guys. All right, now I'm gonna take this same shade and I'm just gonna put it right under my eyes. Let's just do a little bit. Ooh. All right, now I am going to go in with a darker color now. Let's see what we got going on around here. Now I'm gonna actually go back into the eye and add more of that color. I think it looks really pretty. Now, since I have zero eyebrows, um, luckily I don't need to draw any on because I think this looks snatched without it, but 
To finish off the eyes, I am going to be going in with some glitter mascara. Yes, it does exist. And it's by one of my favorite brands, YSL. Oh my god. Now, I was looking up like, okay, what do you use for mascara for this? You can't just use a normal fucking, like, like what am I going to use? I don't even know. So, I found this. Oh my god, that is so hard to read. Vinyl Couture Mascara. I've never used this before. I got it um, on Sephora, and I think it's the perfect time to use it. So, if you see, it is like a graphite black like charcoal beautiful look at this that silver in there though oh my god all right now we're just gonna go in with this i have no idea if it works so uh let's give it a whirl all right now we're gonna do the bottoms now i'm not really seeing that crazy of a difference it's definitely making my lashes a little darker there's barely any glitter on them but hey the idea was cute <sighs> it's a little underwhelming so <laughs> sorry Next. Okay, so I told myself if the mascara was bomb, I was not going to do lashes, but since it kind of flopped, I am going to put on some lashes. Definitely think that's uh, needed and necessary, so I'm going to be going in with the New Bounce Some Serengeti Lashes. These are so stunning, and shout out to Manny for putting me onto the style because it's sickening. So I'm going to quickly pop these on, and let's see how they look. All right, the lashes are on. I'm feeling this fantasy. I think we do need a little bit of blush and of course a lip. So for blush, I'm gonna be going in with a rose gold glitter. Let's see what we got going on here. Okay, so the blush looks a little bit like this on the brush. It is really soft, kind of rose goldy. And I'm just gonna try to pat it in here. I have so much going on. It might look fucking crazy. Uh, it's all right. I mean, honestly, what? <sighs> glitter on top of glitter on top of glitter. My face is like, what the hell are we doing? I feel like there could be a little bit more highlight. So I found this new Burberry gold glitter. Oh, look how chunky that is. I love a good chunky glitter. Now this is called, oh my God, gold glitter number one to shimmer dust. All right, Burberry. Ooh, girl. I'm actually gonna maybe press that on my lid as well. This shit is bomb. Let's just press a little bit in there for fun. <gasps> oh! Ooh! Oh, okay. Yes. And a little there. Come on, gold. Cute. I'm living for it. All right, now, last but not least, the lips. All right, now we're gonna go in with the Glitter Injections Hot Pink Glitter in shade Cherry Pie. Ooh! <sighs> I'm excited for this one. I'm like, fuck. Okay, and I'm gonna go back in with the Nether Artiste brush and we're just gonna see what happens. All right guys, the lip is on. This look is complete. I definitely think I need some hair. Maybe the same hair I used in my full face highlighter video for just a little throwback. So I will be right back. All right, guys, this is the final, final look. I feel like Barbie on acid right now. I don't even know, but <laughs> that one star on the tip of my nose is giving me anxiety. There we go. Oh, look, and now it's on my nail. Mm, whatever. All right, guys, I had so much fun with this challenge. I don't know how the hell I'm gonna take it off. I feel like maybe the blooper should be me trying to get all this shit off in my bathroom. I don't fucking know. But um, stick until the end, which I guess we are at the end. So in a second, I'm gonna attempt to take all this off. Um, I'm scared, honestly. I am scared for my life. Do you wanna know why? Because I don't wanna take it off. I really could look like this forever. I think this is an easy, everyday, you know, just quick summer bronze look. And um, I'm feeling the fantasy. No, but um, I don't know you guys, I'm attracted to anything sparkly, so I'm just staring in the camera like, mm -mm, that under eye highlight might be my new thing. Now, for my own brand, I am working on a concealer that will be out later next year, and I might just fill up the whole thing with star glitter and fuck the concealer, because this shit looks good. <laughs> All right, you guys, thank you so much for watching. <sighs> another challenge. I think we've done so many full faces this year. I just want to give a shout out to everybody that did one after me and Nikki did our videos. There has been just a million all over the internet and it is so fun to watch. So continuing on the legacy, I had a lot of fun with this and um, mwah. as always, I'll see you on the next one. <laughs> Bye guys. Whew. Step one is we're going to take off this damn wig. 
Oh my god, this is like, I almost want to sleep in this, but then I feel like my bed would be ruined. So we're just going to go ahead and attempt to take this all off. Also, these lashes have got to come off first. I don't want to go blind. And then these contact lenses, oh my god. Right now, normally when I take off my makeup, I use the Clinique Take the Day Off Balm and some MAC wipes, so I guess. So I'm just going to take this Clinique Take the Day Off Balm. A lot of it, I might even need more. Now, this kind of melts off your makeup instantly with the glitter, though. Oh my. And here's where you would get some hot fucking water and pray it comes off. I almost hates when you grab the wipes and 10 come out. I'm like, bitch, I only want a one. But today, I probably will need a 100. All right, here's the scary part now. If I go blind, everybody, it was really uh, nice seeing you all. And uh, around the eyes, though, it's tricky because if a chunk falls in there and you rub it, well, it's over. <sighs> okay, I think I'm going to go see if Nathan can get some of this off. Um, insert porn joke here. And um, all right, guys, when I'm filming my next video, I might still have glitter on me, but uh, fuck it. <laughs>